Hello, hello everyone, and welcome to another Let's Play. I'm Miles Dyer, and today we are playing... Hmm, I wonder if only there was some kind of clue on screen of what kind of game we might be playing, or what it could even be called. By the way, if you're looking here at my heart rate, you'll see it's quite high. It's because I've just been scrambling from down there. I couldn't get the speech chat working, because right now I can hear all of you in my ears. Hello to all of you. Uh, but it does mean my heart rate looks unhealthily high. I'm actually feeling good right now, even though it does look pretty terrifying. But it has been a long journey. Um, before I get involved in this world, I just want to say a massive thank you to everyone who is tuned in and watching. Because um, my first ever PSVR 2 Let's Play, as in a game on its own, was Resident Evil Village. And it did very well because obviously I was an absolute terrified mess. And since then I've played over 130 PSVR 2 titles. And the support I've had from this community has been absolutely amazing. So firstly, from the bottom of my now more moderately beating heart, I just want to say a massive thank you. And this feels like a really special occasion because I've played a lot of horror games since. I'm not sure how I'm going to do, but I know as soon as you get into this world, it feels really real. Um, also, when I did Resident Evil Village, I wasn't on green screen. I was terribly positioned, standing in the middle of a room. I have a tripod now. I have a massive setup. It's all looking a lot better, and it's all because of the amazing support of this community. So that's it from me. We're just going to dive into this. Keep me company. I hear you in my ears, and if you're watching on replay, love you as well. Uh, do hit the like button. If there was ever a time to hit the like button, please make it be this one. And do subscribe and ring the bell to be notified of all future Let's Plays because I'm on a mission to Let's Play every single PSVR 2 game out there. And I'd love to have you join me on that journey. Let's do this. Terrifying music. Right, I'm standing. Dominant hand. Okay, VR mode. Yeah, blah, blah, blah. Uh, let's go into options. Uh, right, what have we got here? VR controls. Throwing controls. Well, I'm going to keep it all. Right, we don't want snap turning. We want smooth turning. And smooth turn speed. We want it fast. I'm already starting to feel anxious. Camera controls. Oh, no, I don't want to invert. Quick turns. Um, what else we got here? Was that it, I think? Quick. Or is it? No. I think quick turns I want off. Um, okay, and then VR settings. Is there like um, crouch type, hold, toggle, VR headset? Yeah, okay. And then there's so much customization. Is there like a tunnel or something effect? Like a tunneling? Here we go, low. I want it off. All first person. Good. Lots of uh, customization, but I think we're ready to go. Um, main story, new game. I want standard, because I'm a standard person. Receive a tutorial. Yeah, let's do a tutorial. The tutorial in Resident Evil Village scared the hell out of me. <laughs> do you remember that garage in the dark? That was horrible. I'm not looking forward to this. Wow. This looks fantastic. Uh, yep, I know how to reset the viewpoint. Thank you very much. Look at this. Wow. Look at my arms. I like this. Can I not give the thumbs up? Okay. Okay. T turn turn the scare meter down to zero. By the way, let me know how it looks visually uh, and, the, and the sound levels because I can change them if needs be. Can I? No, can't play chess. Not that I would uh, want to uh, play chess. Okay. Oh, might need some... Uh, oh. Oh, I've got to eject it first. Might want to aim first. Grab. Nice. Ready ammo. Can I, oh, it's just one at a time. Pump. Can I single pump it? Oh! Ah. That's nice telling me to pull the trigger again but nice 
That concludes the weapons practice tutorial. Simplified weapon reloading is also available. Nah. Reloading and other VR specific settings can be adjusted in the option. Yeah, I know it's going to be dark, but the thing is I can make it lighter if it needs to be. That's cool. Let me uh, let me change the gamma a little bit then. There we go. That should be a bit better for you. Where you go? Um, here we go. Is this just for more practice? I just want to see what the... Oh, man. Right. Oh, pause menu. Okay. Oh, tutorials. Confirm. Oh, do you have to go... Wait. Do I have to go back? Tutorials? Am I being an idiot here? Options? No. That concludes the tutorial. Exit by selecting... Qu oh, you've got to quit. Okay. This is a bit... The um, RE8 tutorial looked a lot better. This looks great. This looks awesome in the headset, even the flat screen. This stuff right here is amazing. Straight away, I just think of all the PSVR 2 games I've played where the flat screen cutscenes haven't looked great. September 30th, and I'm like, is that just because I'm expecting too much? No. Clearly, cinematics can look amazing in the headsets. And that night, Raccoon City was wiped out. Thanks to the bioweapons. So just to let you know everyone, I actually never played Resident Evil 4. Not the original, not the remake. This is my first time experiencing the story. I was asked later to join a top secret government program. Not that I had a choice. The training. Punishing missions. Nearly killed me. But at least I kept my mind off everything. If I could just forget what happened that night. The pain. Even for a second. This time, it can be different. It has to. Oh, the hat ticks. So tell me, Yankee. Why did you come to this horrible place? As close to nowhere that I've ever seen. I assume they're gonna die. Let's just say, looking for someone. That someone must be very important, huh? The chief gave the orders himself. Help him, he said. I'm sure your boys didn't come all the way out here to roast marshmallows. <laughs> Are the volume levels all right, people? Maybe you did. You have a strange sense of humor. I'm gonna let you in on a little secret. Just between us. A lot of people have gone missing around here. And it's been that way for a while now. Well then. Should be just another day in the office, right? Mm. I mean, last week there was a search for some missing hikers. I'm sure you'll do your best to help me. <laughs> Volume's good. Thank you. This is it. Nature calls, huh? I'll be right back. Thank you for being my producers. Good for you. The yeah, music has dropped my heart rate, yeah. It was nice. Soothing. You smoke? Nah. I 
Vaya sitio más tétrico. It'd be cool if you could experience this in the VR, like you're sat in the car. But I get it. They turned this around in what, nine months? The VR mode? Which is incredible. He sure is taking his time. Did he fall in? Maybe you better go and take a look. See, as the door is opening, you feel the haptics in the headset, and again, when it closes, it's the most subtle haptics that I think are the most impactful. Yeah, even with the bushes there. Uh, sorry, I mean the, the branches. You can feel it in your hands. Really good. Although, if I was to be petty, I'd say you should only feel it in your left hand then. Wow, look at this. Look at that. Wow. Chapter one. See what's taking so long. Look. Yep. Yeah, I get it. I mean, the sounds and the effects are incredible. This looks great. And uh, I'm just checking to see. Yeah. I mean, it's a dark game. Try not to pick up the boot on the trash can. The right was <laughs> too late. I'm assuming everyone's done that. How far could he have gone? Okay, that's uh. not, that's not nice. Uh. Oh great. Uh. Uh. Now what I've learned. Lower head to crouch. I love that. You've got to just lower your head like that. Please tell me. You, you must be able to pick that up. What? Is that going to open? Oh, wait. What's going on? Anyone home? I was literally about to say that. Oh, Apple. Wish you could pick this stuff up. This is all pretty... Pretty... Pretty creepy. Okay. Judgment is nigh. Okay. So I want to like open all the drawers and that, but I see you can't. This is uh, pretty remarkable. I don't like these corners like this. Okay, this doesn't look good. Now, that means you've got to use a key, right? Okay. Oh, it's weird that some doors open normally, like, you know, they're played out, but you're in the head. I guess it's because it's going straight into a cutscene. Oh, wow. So, Guy, if that was in VR, that would have been so freaky. You know what I mean? You turn and someone's there. Uh, sorry to barge in like this. Let's go out on police yet. Wow. We don't even get to fight him. Oh. You know, 
VR quick time ev events would be cool, right? Wow, look. This is not good. I know this is not good. Okay. Okay, that's cool. Okay, now it's dark. Oh my goodness. This is the stuff I don't like. Reminds me of Barbarian. Ba, 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 ba. Okay, there's something lying there. And oh, can I. Sh Killed it. Hey, I was holding a knife and a gun. And then it switched back. Hey. Oh, he doesn't look good. I read you. Situation. Okay, what are my feelings right now? My feelings are RE Village had a much stronger intro for VR. But, you know, we don't know what's going to happen now. But, what was that? I hear someone. There we go. No fucking way. Oh, you can't throw it. Oh no! No! How do I? I'll break free like that. Okay. Or do I have to tap it? Oh, you have to tap it. Okay. That was quite hard to see. I like that someone at the beginning of the stream says you're probably not going to die. I'm going to die. Right, continue. Okay. What was that? No fucking way. Okay, that was much better. Looks pretty fierce. Oh. Oh. Was that holstered? How do I holster it? Or does it automatically holster it? Okay. Okay, someone's someone's there. Hey. Done. Fatal knife attacks. Okay. No. Oh, roundhouse kicks are cool, but you can't do them in VR. I mean, I understand. That was pretty fast. Okay, the bodies have gone. That's not good. Right. Oh, wait. Oh, man. Every time you expect to open the door, it goes to a cutscene. By the way, massive hello to everyone who's tuned in. Hope you're doing good. Oh, that's not good. Bruce, this is Condor One. Hunnigan here, what's your sit rep? The president's daughter, Baby Eagle. It's likely she's in this village. Our intel was correct then. Well done. 
Need a location on a nearby lake. She may have been taken there. Copy that. I'll see what I can find. Hurry up. Something's happened to the people here. My escorts are... That's scary. God, that sound up the stairs was terrifying. See, again, if that was in VR, that would have been really scary. I'll let myself out. Now, I'm just hoping it's the intro. There's a lot of cutscenes in that. Oh man, it seems like every time it goes back into VR though, it's great. But don't forget, this is VR mode, it's not a VR game. This is cool. The game looks great. There is reprojection going on, but, you know, it's just a gorgeous environment. Hey, there's a big... Status. And I hear that if you sheath your weapon, your knife itself, you actually get uh, more durability. Right. Now, does that mean does that mean I've lost that bullet that was left in the magazine? It said plus one, so I'm assuming I do pick it up. God, every time I try and holster it... Oh, I've got to holster it in front of me. Okay, we've got a typewriter here. Yeah, the positioning of stuff is interesting. Okay. Okay. That's saved. I don't know if I should be using my knife on some of those human enemies. Hear people there. I want to shoot those crows. No, they can definitely hear me now. I mean, that was stupid. No. Oh. Now, all I do know is that famously in the PS2 game, you actually rescue the dog, the, the, the wolf. Okay. Okay, go. So this is where I can leave stuff behind, I'm guessing. Is that what it means? Oh, no, no. Okay, I pressed the wrong button, that's why. Sorry, I'm an idiot. Okay. Like it's a... Here we go. We've got, we got, we got them running around. As I always joke, this is just like a night out in my local town. They're not scary. Here we go. I mean, doing that is awesome. Oh, I parried it. Oh, wow. Okay. That was interesting. So my initial thoughts are, I'm having so much fun, but it's night and day compared to my experience of RE Village. Okay, watch that. No, you can't use it. Okay. Also, another reason Another reason why I don't think I'm as scared is because in RE Village, you're playing as Ethan. 
who goes through a lot of brutality in RE7, and you definitely feel like more grounded. In this, you're playing Leon Kennedy. Leon MF in Kennedy, who's like a hero. Like, I'm here. I'm here to kick ass. And that definitely changes the dynamics of how a game feels, in my opinion. I mean, it's cool being stood next to him. Oh, there was a head. Head there. Look at this. Okay, this looks. This looks incredible right now. Now, I know there's that famous scene in the village where you're running away from everyone. Is this it? Sorry. This is just so ridiculous. I don't know, I'm finding this super easy. Here we go. Classic. I'm sure this is going to feel tense now. I l you can parry a... By the way, when I said this reminds me of a night out in my local town, I don't do this. <laughs> my name is Miles Dyer with my knife. Miles Dyer hard. So I want to reset the camera right now, but I don't want to skip it. Hydrate quickly. That's very true. RE eight was um, out in the dark and stuff. This you're outside, yeah. Where's everyone going? Bingo? Nice. I didn't pick up all the stuff people dropped. Or can I now? Yes. Bruce Condor One. I've identified oh, that's cool. Lake. Look for a large windmill. There's a path on the far side of it. Windmill. Copy that. And be careful. Bruce out. The map. How do I bring the map up? Yeah, I know I can craft. I don't want to craft at the moment. How was it? How did they say bring the map up? Is it that? No. Is it? No, that was the noise. I'm going to have to look how to... How do we do the map? The map. Here we go, the map. The map can be opened with in the quick menu. Or 
Oh, I turned off. Um, I turned off quick turn actually. So let me just quickly do that. Quick turn. There we go. Okay. Right. It's time to start exploring. They said about, was it the windmill or something? These people are sick. Yeah. Where are you, Leon? I mean, we could search all the houses, I guess. Hello? Oh, and that's the stuff you can use to block windows and stuff. Oh, nice. Okay. No. Okay. What? So you can't punch it. You have to press X. Oh, come on. Again, VR mode, not a VR game. Is there someone in there? No. Nice. Is that actually wasting bullets when I do that? I don't know. 5-3? No. Interestingly enough, I might end up enjoying this more than Village because I'm less scared. Um, but we'll see. Like, I'm, I'm not here to say I'm less scared and then like you go, ah. Can you jump out? Oh, okay, vaulting over you do in VR. That's cool. Happy Resident Evil 4 day to you as well. Welcome. Hope you're doing good. Right. Oh, I need a key. They didn't drop anything. Move! Move! Oh, this looks like something nice. Okay, that needs a key. Jesus Christ! What happened to my knife? Take that, you dick. Well, that wasn't nice. Oh. I can't punch it, but you can just press X on it. That's good to know. He didn't drop anything, did he? He didn't drop a key for his own chest, no. Okay. Okay. Ah, it's locked. Am I less scared because I'm building a tolerance? I mean, that might be part of it. I've been pretty brave this year. Dead cow lord. I look forward to that. I guess we're going up here now then. At least I got this. This is 
horrible. Ruby. I'm just waiting for someone to be under under the blankets and being like, "There, I didn't want to get up." So you've been doing that in VR would be cool. There it is. So the durability, I don't know how you improve the durability. Right, we're at a safe point. Here we go. Absolutely, if there were giant spiders, different story. Cosmo Dread. I had to stop playing that. Okay. What? That's so weird. Oh, that's what it does. Okay. Just keeping it, keeping it in there. You mean? Won't open. So yeah, you go to stab from behind, and then it. I'd rather it was like you click R two to do it than using R two going for the stab, and then it takes you out the cutscene. Here's the windmill. on the uh, social screen. Cool. See, it's completely inconsistent. Sometimes you pick stuff up, sometimes you press X. Okay, we can do that. I don't know if you could press X to break them on uh, RE8. Interesting. Can we deactivate it? Yep. Okay, can we climb up ladders? Or is it gonna... Hmm. I'm getting quite annoyed with all these things that take you out the VR mode. Again! Having else. a good time, just yeah. There's a lot of disappointment in the mechanics. Yeah, I guess that's the difference, isn't it? RE8 was first person, even on the flat screen. Yeah, ahí está as well. Whatever that is. You coming out? Or can I come out? That's it. I'll come in. <laughs> now I hear something down here. Oh, there's something big out there, I think. Oh, there's a lot of them out there. What is that? That doesn't sound good. I feel like I shouldn't drop down. There we go, it doesn't matter anyway. He's coming in. Oh shit, I wasn't meant to do that. Damn it. Oh. Can I pick this up? No. So have I lost my knife forever now? Is that what's happened? Whoa! 
Can I use that knife? No. Oh, I've got another knife. The melee is hilarious. It feels great. Can I swap hands? Oh. Yeah, don't don't do spoilers of upcoming events, please. Not just for my benefit, but for everyone else's. Oh, they turn into this stuff. That's pretty cool. I want to wear his mask. That's pretty sick. Hello, chicken. I saved you. Check you out. Get it? Check, check you out. Oh, what's going on there? Oh, I can push you as well. Okay. And then that happens. Okay, interesting. My bad. Serves me right. Serves me right. Okay. Brown egg. Let's have a look here. Setting weapon shortcuts. Here we go. Ready a weapon by moving your hand to the assigned shortcut. And What's this? Gunpowder? Okay. Wow, we've got loads of stuff here. Can be used to restore health. Just use the eggs now. Oh, is my health full? Is that for shield, that bit? Okay. And then we got, like... Chicken attacks me, I'll kick it in the head. Need to get through there. Mm. Hmm. Where do we need to go now? Oh, this side. <laughs> and then it turns out it just takes us back here. Yeah, mm, great. Hmm. Now these, what are these? Are you meant to shoot these? Yes, you are, because I saw another one at another window, so I'll have to remember that. Oh, there's one there. Where to go now? Now, I... Oh, there's the map. Okay, here we go. Okay, it says there's something there. Oh, and there's a medallion. It shows you where the medallions are. Oh, okay, that feels like cheating. But, fine. There must be a quick way of getting to the menu. There's one over here. Yeah. Okay, and then there's one straight ahead, like it's saying, in the... Right, we'll go back up there then. 
I mean, look, even though it's not done as a cutscene, it still looks pretty cool. Oh yeah, I, uh, I found one of these. There we go. There we go. Ba both sticks in at once. Maybe if I hold them down? No. No. Quick turn's pretty cool. Haven't been out here yet, I don't think. Or had I? Had I been out this way yet? I think this is a different way. Oh. Flagon. Combining treasures. Oh, there's so much here. Okay. Can I use this? Yeah. Oh, we're back in here. This looks incredible. Look at this. It is just, um, it's amazing. Hold it. The switching from third to first person is done very well, though. Now, the resolution's pretty decent. Um, you know, there is reprojection, but... Look, I'm at, I feel good. It's a beautiful to look at game. Like when you're standing still, it looks amazing. But then when you're moving around, but that's because of reprojection. What's that? Oh, that was my gun I accidentally threw down. Un forastero. Un forastero. Or whatever you said. I wonder what they are saying. Hey. I'm assuming, uh... I killed your mum! Oh, okay. Can we have the light on? Can I have a light on? Is there a way to put a light on, or not? I'm being chased. I'll leave him. They all sound Italian. Oh, they're using bombs now. Are they? Are they speaking Italian? Is this just a bunch of? Oh, what's going on? What the hell? Oh, it was the trap. I didn't see that. I just use no you can't punch present for you oh was that me was that one of the I don't know I'm so confused right now it's 
Spanish, thank you. I didn't realise this was in Spain. I clearly haven't been paying attention. Thank you, everyone. Oh. I don't know what I should be doing to make my um, knives. Oh, man. I tried to go round it. Anyone? Want to be efficient? Very efficient. Hello. I am definitely an outsider. Stop lobbing. Stop lobbing dynamite. It's not nice. I got no knife. This looks awesome. This looks great. This looks beautiful. Can we go fishing? Actually, all the fish are dead. Be a boring way to fish. Guys are hilarious. Yo, who's in here? Thank you. All. Nope. Hello. 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 Look, let's test the VR. Does this break? Yes. That's good, guys. That's good. If that didn't break, then I would have been like, yeah, this is rubbish. Yay, yeah, dude. Don't worry. Oh, great. You just drop down. Okay, this is... This this is this is how Resident Evil is at its best. And there's something in the bag. Doing it as a cutscene. Again, if you had to do that yourself, that would have been amazing. That hurts, you know? It seemed like you really wanted to talk. How observant, senor. Now, uh, say, uh, you got a smoke? You know, those things will kill you. Oh, well, maybe just untie me then, huh? <clears throat> Joder, not this guy! Who are you? Just stop right there! Santa Claus. <sighs> it's bad Santa. What? He's done his chapters. Okay. 
complete. Okay. Alright. Got it, got it, got it. Okay. Yep. Okay, chapter two. Next chapter, here we go. There's a cutscene I'm gonna hydrate. Sacrificial lamb, you will receive our most sacred body. It begins now. Mm. Sorry, sorry. I was um I was hydrating and that's what happened. Um okay. <laughs> Sarah, I guess you, me, picked the wrong spot to vacation, eh? Hey, stop it! You move, I move. And I'm beat up enough as it is. I can see you're thinking. Bet you've been in spots like this before, huh? I guess. You're here looking for someone. <clears throat> One more guess. Maybe some missing senorita? Young girl. Talk. Now. Great. See. Her chatter about me. <laughs> My heart rate goes up because I'm going Moving down up. to the ground quickly to get a beer. Where? Who knows? <laughs> but later. Saw some men dragging someone <laughs> to the old church. <laughs> ah, hanging with you. Not help. <laughs> <laughs> See, that would be a cool mini game in VR. We gotta throw the chains and time it. Hey, we're not done here. Later, amigo. Amigo. Shit, they took my gear. Again, every time you come back to VR, it feels awesome. Oh, they took, they took all my gear. Probably, you've seen better days. Yes, Condor what is Wonder this? Roost. I've located Baby Eagle. It sounds like she's being kept in some church. Great, that's good news. I heard it from this guy I met. Said his name is Luis Serra. There's something fishy about him. I need you to run a background check. We'll call Condor One. I'll see what I can find. In the meantime, make your way to that church. Right. Right. We'll probably do for confession anyway. Condor One, out. Hopefully, you can kind of see stuff. I mean, it is very dark in here, to be fair. Head for the church. Kitchen knife. Slash or stab with a knife to attack. Oh, now you tell me. Thanks. Yeah, as I've mentioned from the start, look, I am nitpicking, but they are lots of small complaints. But stealth kills. Why is it telling me this now? I'm learning not to like lunge in because of the way it cuts in. But yeah, it's a VR mode. It's not um Hey, that's my gear. Hey, what up, buddy? Come on. Oh. Why is it giving me the tutorials now? <laughs> See, I wish I could pick up their weapons. 
feels weird. Feels weird you can't use their weapons. Tables in the water is not s bad health and safety. Yeah, I don't think I've. I, I don't know if I've sworn yet. I think I might have sworn a couple of times, but I don't know. Someone could remind me. It won't open for the other side. Okay. No good. Turn my notifications off. Clearly, I don't think you're getting uh, trophies for this. Oh no, that's a very well placed one. Quick, quick! Ah, oh, I was under there. I could have done that easy. One second, guys. Just gonna turn my notifications off. Appreciate everyone wants to be my friend. <laughs> I can go through there. That's good to know. Why can't you turn that in VR? Do you know what I mean? Okay, so you have to... Oh, there are trophies. Okay, cool. I'll be taking these back. I did get a trophy, thank you. Okay. Oh, someone's there. Over here. Stay Over here, time. mate. What up, buddy? Who's that? Let's do some business then. Aye. Yeah, let's do Welcome. some business. Trading with the merchant. Okay. I've got quite a lot of cash, but then I don't know how much stuff is gonna cost. Okay. <laughs> Good stuff, stranger. Nice. I've got something new for you, mate. Here we go. So tune up. Repair the combat knife. If that's good work, oh, here we go. Durability. So okay, I've only got 10,000. Do I want to increase the power or the durability? I feel like the durability. I feel like the guns I was happy Your with. Weapons are in good hands, mate. I'll see you right. Although pistol power would be good, but I've, I've been using the knife a lot. Power or durability? Well, if I increase the power, I'm going to have to stab less with it. But it only goes up from 0.6 to 0.7. Um, and also, if I do this, I can then do two See things. How that feels, mate. Fellow like yourself should notice the difference. Also, I might be able to sell some things. Here we go. Used keys that no longer serve a purpose. And the treasures. But I've got this right. Isn't it worth more if I put something in it? Right, let's come back for a minute. I will. Let me just have a look here. It was telling me that when it came to treasures... 
that you can put these inlaid gemstones. Here we go. So it tells you what it actually does. So I've got two red. I mean, this is cute. Okay. Oh, there it is. There we go. There we go. That's loads. Okay. So is that is that confirmed now? Yeah. Okay. Heard someone. Welcome. I got something new for you. Ruby's all rubbish. It makes no difference. The price. Well, that's our choice. Okay. And then well velvet strong. blue. <laughs> For selling only. Not bad. And then we got herbs. To be honest, the grenades I'm not really going to use, but then I should probably save them in case I do. Your valuables won't do you much good in the grave. Okay, let's tune up. What have I got? I got twenty-one thousand now. So this is great. So I can actually well increase can the power of my knife. Dazzled, and I could increase the durability again. <laughs> but I do think that maybe I should do the power because that's a 1.3 increase. That's pretty awesome. Um, shotgun I've not even used yet. Um, if you want a fighting ch this let's do that. Because it just basically means like if you're, if you're still good with your ammo and that, it's just going to do a lot more damage. Now we've got all these items and stuff. Bolt thrower. Trade. Here we go. So we like our herbs. Ah, okay. Heal a man, kill a man. Laser sight would be Thank nice. <laughs> we would pleasant travels. Right. Oh, what have we got here? Rifle ammo. You didn't want to sell this. It's mine. Mine now. Too slow. Um, right, let's have a look here. Look at all this stuff I've got. Is there a place I can drop it? What about resources, crafting material? Wow, look at all this. I feel like I need to get rid of this stuff. Oh, and look at all these kitchen knives. Right, I should sell kitchen knives. Because I don't need them. I didn't. Oh. Welcome. Mm -hmm. Pleasure doing business with you. These resources. I mean. Got a don't get yourself Let's eat an egg. Now I'm back to full got all these herbs that I've not used yet um, and we've got gunpowder here we go this is it right here we go okay this tells me how to mix stuff up so handgun ammo I mean sure Uh, a mixed herb. I mean, I guess I could mix some together just to take up less space. I've forgotten what these different herbs do, though. Oh, someone says I wouldn't sell knives. Too late. Okay. Let's have a look here. Right, this is looking better. Now, can I can I move them? Or not? Oh, there you go, like that. That's Oh, this is good. This is going to make me feel good. Now, why? Oh, you can rotate it. How do you rotate it? Is it that button? No. Whoops. Sorry, guys. I hate spending so much time in the menu. Is it? Oh, 
Oh, is this the, um, like, where you leave stuff behind, right? Guys, I don't know how you rotate stuff. But, I'm just going to put all this stuff in here, because I'm not going to need it. Mix green herb. I mean, I've already got a... I'll leave that there. This is super cool, though. You can auto-sort. Where is that? Auto-sort. There we go. Oh, you actually turn it with your hand. Oh, there we go. Sorry, my bad. Thank you very much. But auto-sort did good. But what's this? Is this just to put it somewhere before you put it back in? Is that what it is? I think so. Um, cool. Right, we're good. We're good now. Um, I feel like I should save it again. Now that I've done all that. Okay. Right, onwards. See you later, buddy. Nice doing business with... No, okay. Never mind. I thought us brutes were meant to stick together. So I need a lot. I hear a lot of complaining. I hear a lot of complaining. A lot of. <laughs> hey! No, where's my knife gone? Right, where's my knife gone? Did I leave it in the thing? Hello, stranger. Actually, no. Combat knife. No. Oh, okay, so you put it there. Okay. Got it. Okay, that's cool. So you put your shortcuts around you. I got it now. And does that mean with the map as well? No, I don't know. Sorry, guys. I know there's a lot of questions from me. I'll work it out. But I got a new knife now. I feel like I could do the thing. <laughs> they should do a VR game that use the gloves. It electrocutes you when you stab your hand. The laser sight. I think you need to buy it though, don't you? Wow, this is... C look at this! Wow! This looks incredible. It would be a shame if someone were to come along and ruin the atmosphere. Yeah! Hey, dudes. There you go, get down you dicks. Oh, blow up your mates then. Whoa. Okay. Wow, blowing up all your mates, your own mates. It's not nice. If you've ever wanted a roundhouse kick a grandma in the head, get RE4. To... No, I think my health's pretty low. They just keep using dynamite again and again. Where's it go? I know I'm low on health, but 
don't know how I see my health quick. Oh, a key. Small key. It looks like I'm doing a speed run. No way. I'm just playing and trying to survive. I'm playing it my way. God, that is amazing. I feel like the hold in the neck. getting thrown about. Oh, they're at the windows now. Oh. Let's go up. The only way is up. Hexagonal emblem. This looks amazing, honestly. Oh. Out of the way. Out of the way. Do they just keep coming? Or... I love it when it allows you to melee Knock one, down, right? but it won't let you do the other. My knife is pretty uh, knackered. Right, I still don't know if I'm supposed to be like... Is it going to say I picked up three? I don't know. Oh, there we go. And you can pause the game. Okay. How's my health? Okay, my health isn't great. It's seen better days. There we go. There you go. Oh shit! I didn't realise I'd threw. It. That's the second time I've done that where I've thrown something by mistake. Guys, it does. When it goes to third. Oh, shit. He's gonna blow! Okay. Angry Spanish people. Don't make me come up there. Out 
Oh no, I broke my... Oh no. I'm about to die. I don't want to heal. I want to die. If, I, if I'm going to die, because I want to get my uh, dagger back. I can't believe I broke my dagger. It's going to be so expensive to heal. Oh man, you and your Paso. Get down. I probably shouldn't do that because I'm giving the the wrong impression that I'm actually turning it with my hands. But I'm not. I'm not. Whoa! That's awesome. Hello, ladies. Can I treat you for a drink? I'm dead. Sorry, guys. I kind of wanted to die because of my uh, knife. You are dead. Let me just quickly hydrate. Mm-mm-mm-mm. How long have we been going for? An hour and 20, wow. Well, we'll do a hard stop at two hours. Honestly, guys, there's been some slightly tense moments, but not scary, which is a shame. But this, I mean, this is just amazing. Right. Cool. Right, I know what to do this time. Get out of my way. I'm playing on normal. I just love kicking grannies to the ground. Because it's frowned upon in real life. I don't know if, if that's the case where you live as well. that. Oh! I wish stabbed you. I mean, I don't want to sound ageist, but the elderly all look the same here. Oh, I'm not... Okay, how am I doing my knife? Right, time to... Oh, this feels great. Come in, come in. No? I feel like they just. Oh, look at that, that's awesome. Look at that. That is a really great point. I'm not being very empathetic. Let's try it with the next one we meet. Excuse me. How are you feeling today? Why are you so angry? Come down. Let's talk about it. So what's up? Tell me. Whoa. Whoa. I tried. I tried. Can't say I didn't try.
Ooh, piece of candy. Oh, that's what I wanted. Thank you. Hey. In half. Hey. Hey, that wasn't nice. Yeah, my knife doesn't seem to be repairing much. Love the voices. Come on. Hey. Here, let take a seat and we'll chat about it. No? Oh, see, look, he didn't fall through the wall. He slumped against it. That is a small detail that I think is very easy. I mean, he's, his leg's going through the floor. Let, ignore what I was about to say. Right. Let's try and communicate with him. Guten Tag. Be heist. Sticking his tongue out, just going, no. Yeah, we've been up here. Right, we're going. I assume they just keep coming, so I should probably uh, get on with it. Oh, I need to go up there. I'm coming up, so you better get this party started. Coming up, I'm coming. Oh, you can. Fuck, man. Oh, I survived that, though. No! Yeah, it's pretty, pretty nasty. Right. Alright, guys. Sorry. I'll get it right this time. Right, here we go. This is the one, guys. Third time lucky. What we're going to do is we're just going to be really subtle. There you go. Whoa. All the lighting effects, like when stuff's up, is so good. I now know that you shouldn't be using the knife unless it is to finish him off. Out of the way. Oh. I love that you shoot him in the head and they hold their head like they've got like a migraine. Like, oh, I got a bullet in the head. Thank you. 
you have a nap. You have a nice little nap. Right. I think they keep. I think the enemies keep coming. I don't know. I still don't know yet. I'm a cat. I'm a kitty cat. I like it goes black and white. When you pick up an item, that's pretty cool. Oh, mate. Stop lobbing dynamite. It's so boring. Get a real hobby. So good. Amazing. Amazing. Yeah, I'm on normal. I should be playing on a harder mode because this is too easy. I say that as I'm dying, but I'm not really playing very cautiously. Right, that was third time lucky. If I die on this section, we're, we're calling it quits on the stream. Uh... Um, okay, let's do this. Right. I'm going to do less messing around in there. That's it. Dynamite went over my shoulder there, that was pretty cool. Yeah, to be honest, I should have been using my healing. I think it's because I'm just used to playing modes where you can't really rely on healing. Oh, dude, I love how they go flying. It's so good. Give me a break already. How am I doing? All right, let's get this right. Oh shit. One Come on, give me a melee. Uh, no, now's not the time for that. Do I need to press anything? No. No. 
the melee, not to do that. Right, we're good. Quick! Quick! Oh. Out of the way. That was crunchy. Now I've done that. What did that actually control? It's just that there. Nice. Wanna get down to there, so can I jump down off this bit? Yep. That's nice, I like that. I like that a lot. Oh, I do want to quickly. There we go, through here. Out we go. Much better. Or was this the way we came in? It was, wasn't it? So, uh... Oh, but it was that that I needed. Got it. Right. Is that... That's got good durability still. That's good. See? When I had the pressure, thinking, oh, the stream could be over. If I mess this up... Oh, I've got to rotate it to... Oh, you can turn it around, though. So it's... I'd say it's that. I love this stuff. But you can't... Why can't you turn that? I want to turn it around myself. What up, buddy? Take a look. Something's bound to catch your eye. Yeah, well, I don't want to buy anything. I just want to stop buying, so I appreciate what you're doing. Hope you keep him well. Send my love to the, to the family. Later. Actually, I'll just save it here. Wanna do that? Wanna do that in VR? Crouch under here. <coughs> Take that. It's going right in my basket. Ooh, piece of candy. <sighs> I'm Leon Kennedy. I'm here to kick ass and take names, but I'm a rowdy names. See, I'd love slashing the boxes with my... How much do you get for that? 120. Is a bullet worth 120? Probably not. Yeah, the only thing that scared me so far was the man in the cupboard. That was... Oh. Destroy the wind-up dolls. Okay. When I hear someone with their uh, motor. Oh, let's uh, remember. It's that and that. There we go. Hmm. What's that, though? Oh, there was something down there. Okay. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. 
So it's got one out of four one. Do I lose the... What up, dude? Let's talk. Can I parry that with my... Oh. My knife. Are more coming? Well, this guy seems pissed. What's your problem, man? Unkillable. Find out. <laughs> Feeling this? No. Don't think you can kill him. So I'm just going to get past him. Unless the chat wants to tell me I can kill him, in which case I will stay and try. But. I think he's just misunderstood. <clears throat> you can kill. Okay. Okay. I'm going to get loads of people telling me I can kill him now. Lots of rubies. Oh, this is nice. Not too shabby. Someone has shown up their neighbors. Parry the chainsaw with your combat knife. It's amazing. Oh. I don't know what this is yet. This is nice. It's like actual environments out the window. Look at that. That's cool. Like it. Small, another small key. I guess we'll go upstairs. Well, if he's out here. Hey, mate. Look, we got off on the wrong foot, and I just want to say I'm sorry. There you go. Gone. <laughs> so ridiculous. Fuck. Yeah. Oh, sound like he shot himself. Horrible way to go. Okie dokie, let's go upstairs. The old farm, okay, so it's the crop, pig, and then the babe. Crop. Right, crop, pig, babe. Oh, yeah. oh shit! Sorry, I didn't know you were taking a shit. I'm really sorry, man. Oh, what did you eat? Uh, can I? Oh, I'd like to close the door. Crop, pig, babe. Crystal marble. I'm guessing.
guessing that goes up into that. Oh. Yeah, I should have knocked first. Room service. Room service. That's cool. Oh, rotate. See, this is cool. Even though it's done on a flat screen. I feel like I'm terrible at this. Well, I feel like that's pretty close. There we go. Almost. Hello. Room service. It's knowing when you pick up stuff and then when you... Powerful man. He's going to inject me again, and that's the end of the chapter, right? Is this what's happening? The blood has accepted the gift. There we go. Well, everyone. Those. I'm going to get chapter results. My accuracy is pretty decent. everyone that was resident evil 4 vr mode chapters one and two um i want to say a massive thank you to everyone for tuning in this was definitely a really really good time uh so for my final thoughts and actually i think this speaks volumes if you watch my resident evil village uh let's play and i always recommend watching the video on my channel because i've added a swear counter as well as a as the heart monitor but, um, you know, the Let's Play format has evolved a lot. It starts with a trailer. Um, I've obviously got green screen now. Um, and uh, I also like to sort of give you my final thoughts at the end. So, visually, this game looks stunning. Um, I mean, this Resident Evil 4 here looks amazing right now. Um, all the flat screen um, cinematics look really, really great. It shows you that watching, you know, videos and movies in a PSVR 2 headset can totally be done. Um, I just love the lighting. Um, there's very little shimmering in the foliage, which is usually a big issue when it comes to VR games, but there is reprojection. Um, and when you're turning in that, there is that kind of ghosting effect that you get. I'm just saying that. It doesn't spoil it for me. Obviously, I'd rather it didn't happen, but the game looks absolutely gorgeous. So I think visually, this game, if you know, you played uh, Resident Evil Village, you're gonna have a good time with this. Um, audio, the the weapons, the sound of the enemies, um, the music, the mood, it's excellent. Really, really, really good. You know exactly what you're getting with a Resident Evil game. Uh, and the haptics, all the weapons, the feeling. I was mentioning at the beginning in the cutscenes, you know, as Liam was getting out of the car and opened the door, 
the sense controller vibrated, and again, as he slammed it. It's the subtleties that can really make a difference. Um, gameplay. Interesting. So, am I having fun with this? Absolutely. This is a blast. Um, it's really, really, really good. But this is a VR mode, and I think a lot of people in the chat said it very well, which was Resident Evil Village was a first-person game, and so switching that to VR... Um, you know, still would have been a challenge, but it meant that there was less need to take you out of the uh, the VR uh, for like third person events. On this, there is an awful lot of third person events, even though I have in the options first person chosen all the way down. I would even say the roundhouse kick, although it happens very quickly, I would love to just experience that in VR um, because it would just being able to look around as it happens. Um, it's also some really weird decisions so like when enemies are down it tells you to press R2 with the knife to like finish them off but you press R2 to get the knife out but you don't actually do that to do the finishing you have to actually do the action so you go in and lunge and then it puts you into the sort of the, the, the cut the sort of the, uh, the, 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 the animation of finishing them off which is different to necessarily how you swung it so there seems to be a disconnect there climbing up ladders um, turning handles um, opening doors I feel like there's just a lot of really tiny missed opportunities I think the very biggest one was right at the very beginning when there's a massive boot you want to pick it up and look at it and you can't pick it up and it's like that's such an obvious thing to look at and a lot of people were joking about it in the chat um, and so, yeah, I mean, it's hard not to compare it to Resident Evil Village. Resident Evil Village for me, and, and maybe it was because Resident Evil, uh, sorry, PlayStation VR 2 was still fresh for me. But um, my memory of Resident Evil Village was it was so much more tense. Obviously, it was a different feeling of a game. I always understood Resident Evil 4 to be more of an action-based game. There were two moments that made me jump. But overall, I feel like I'm a hero in a movie and I'm just here to kick ass. Um, and so there isn't really much of a fear factor um, and therefore for some of you who Resident Evil Village was too scary for I would say well maybe this is a good one to um, step into and give a go because you do get those scary environments and look I've only completed two chapters I don't know how many chapters are in the game but there is still um, a, lot, a long way to go and you know I might be eating my hat later on the line when I find out it's really uh, really scary but also just to say that um, I also find the game to be incredibly easy at the moment. I'm playing on standard. I should have probably played it on a harder difficulty. Whereas with Resident Evil Village, um, again, maybe if I went back, I'd find it easier. Um, I actually found it a lot harder in the earlier uh, earlier modes. So, um, look, what are my final thoughts? I freaking love this game. I've given it criti given criticisms, um, but I always do. There are things that um, I find to be a shame. But I'm having a really, really good time of it. And I'm looking forward to uh, seeing it through to the end. So, yeah. Those are my thoughts. What are your thoughts? Um, I would love to hear them. Have you played Resident Evil uh, 4, the remake? Have you played it in VR mode yet? Which is a free uh, upgrade. And also, I do believe Resident Evil 4, at the point of this recording, is still on discount. So, if you were on the fence, why not pick it up? Give it a go. I mean, it really is PSVR 2 at its best. Um, and Capcom, I'm just really glad, is you know bringing the AAA to experiences uh, to to this headset. Um, I want to say a massive thank you once more to everyone that's been watching in the live chat and chatting away in my ears. Uh, it's always a pleasure, and I want to say much love to everyone that's watching on replay. Do let me know your thoughts in the comments section, and also there'll be a lot of you there who perhaps started watching this and thought I don't want it spoiled. I'm going to go play it myself. If you do come back, let me know how you're getting on. I would love to hear from you. But that's all from me, Miles Dyer. Uh, thank you for checking out this Let's Play. Do hit the like button on your way out. We'd really, really appreciate it. And do subscribe. Um, the data has shown me lately that only 50% of people that have been watching these Let's Plays are actually subscribed to my channel. So if you enjoyed this, um, know that I am on a mission to Let's Play every single PSVR 2 game out there. There's already 130 titles on my channel. So do check it out. Um, and yeah. I will leave it there. So thanks so much for watching. Take good care of yourself. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.